Hello, my fellow YouTubers. So this is going to be a video about my, my piercings because I think that it is totally hip to stick needles through your face. Not, 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 not literally. But yeah, pretty much my hair is pink. Wow, Emma changed her hair again. That's a shocker. Not really. If anyone seen my other channel, which I will link on my face, so click on my face. If anyone's seen that channel, they would know that my hair is pink. And it's been pink for like... <sighs> it's been pink for about... <laughs> it's sticking up now. It has been pink for about two weeks now, I think. Three weeks. Three weeks. <sighs> yeah. My hair is pretty much as dead as it can get. I'm joking, it's not. It could be a lot worse. It's actually not that bad at all. It just looks really bad right now because it is like a giant ball of frizz. And there is a bee flying around. Oh my god, it's a bee. So yeah, I'm filming on my iPod again because I'm just that much of a rebel. Rebellious. I have seven piercings. So obviously you can see one right now. It's on my face. Yeah, it's my nose. No, I'm joking. That would that would look bad. I have my eyebrow pierced. And I've had it for... Five months now? Five, I think. I've had it for about five months now. I have like quite a, like a large, like, length pierced. I have to go to my piercer to get the right length of bar and buy jewelry from there, but I can buy like the balls and just screw them on like right now. You can't really tell because it's not that noticeable, but um, it has like little diamonds on the top. Yeah, so I'm wearing that right now. And I had a clear one in yesterday and the day before that because it was Easter. My grandparents were over and they love piercing so much. So I had that and that, I don't find piercings hurt at all for me. So pretty much it was just I went there and she like grabbed my skin because she doesn't like to use clamps, pierce that I went to. And she jabbed a needle through it because, you know, that's how you get a piercing. Um, <clears throat> the pain for that was probably like, I don't know, like a two out of a ten. It didn't hurt at all. It was just like, Mer, okay, done. It did swell after, so I looked like Igor. I was like, wait, wrong eye. I wasn't like that, but it was like, it was swollen. And I had a headache, but other than that, it was, it was great. So my next piercing, I'm gonna take on my flower, is on my ears. So pretty much on this ear, I have I'm wearing a normal earring right now because I'm obsessed with cows and my ears are stretched. So I just wear earrings with my tunnel thingies and just a regular like 20 gauge second hole. So my first hole, which is stretched, is stretched to a size 6. So it is very small and I think... I just got a new pair of like double flared plugs and I cannot put them in my ear because I know that um, wearing double flared plugs with stretched ears at a small size is really hard but they it just won't work like am I doing it wrong or something like I'm not like just shoving it through my ear like I've watched videos and it's just kind of obvious how to put them in is you just like try yeah you can search it if you don't know what I mean by I'm doing it right it's not gonna happen a lot of people want to know what it looks like with it out even though it's not that big so I'll do that I guess yeah, there's a ironing thingy behind me just cause, just cause there is. Okay, so here's my tunnel. Yeah, that's my ear hole thingy. I've had them at a six for probably two months now. Yeah, it has to be at least two months. I think the biggest I would go is a zero. But that's even pushing it a bit. I'd probably go to a 2. I kind of want to go to a 2. But I kind of want to go to a 4 just because there's a pair of plugs there and they just look bigger than... Yeah, okay. We get it. My initial ear piercings didn't hurt at all. Like, like at first when I got them done, because I think I got my first done hole... My first hole done when I was in about grade 3. So I was like... 9. I was 9 or 8. And um, it didn't hurt. Like, I was literally like, oh, is she going to do it now? And they were like, oh, we did it, sweetie. So I was like, oh, 
That was pathetic. I was in the mall one day, sporadically, with my aunt, and I was just, Aunt, see, I want to get my ears pierced. And she was like, okay. So we went to Claire. They're there, and they're like, no, you have to have your parent guard in. Um, I went back later with my mom, and I got them done. And then my second hole, <clears throat> I got when I was in grade six. So I would have been 11, 10, 11. I was 11. Yeah, I was 11 when I got them done. I think I got them done for Christmas or something. <clears throat> And I was with my friend and she nearly passed out because she like freaked out when I got them done. Even though she has her ears pierced herself, she just doesn't do well with piercings. But both those piercings literally hurt like nothing at all. And then stretching them, I probably did something really stupid and I really don't want to get into what I did at first. But like saying this in a short story, none of the stores around me sell small tapers. So pretty much I got a size 8 taper and obviously knew that I wasn't going to go because I was I had stretched up a bit before. But at the time I think I was at like a 16 or a 14 and I was, no, this isn't going to happen. So pretty much um, I ended up wearing earrings, like hoop earrings, like I'll get them. I'm right into my room because I'm just that much of a rebel. This was the earring and I just like, because there's a little post there, I just slid the whole thing in my ear and had it like that and that... That irritated my ears a lot. That was bad. That was like infection waiting to happen. And I pretty much cut off the ends of this because I do synchronized swimming and I could not wear these while swimming. And I had like little posts in my ears. I ended up going to the store like after two days or three days of having those in when I could actually go to the store and got a pair of, of 10 gauge ones, 10 gauge plugs because that's the size that I thought I was at. And I just like put them in my ear and it hurt actually. Well, the stretching the night that I hurt so badly because I kept trying to get them in all the way because I was like I don't have anything to put in them so that hurt I advise you not to do that that was like the stupid thing that I did in life yeah I'm, I'm a smart person you can't yeah okay and then on this year I have four four I just have like my six gauge again with the cow earring through it and my normal earring and um and then I have my tragus pierced and my my helix. So pretty much I've had my helix since the end of grade, middle of grade seven, somewhere in there. So I was 12. But pretty much I got that done with a gun. Yes, scream at me. My cartilage is fine. It is okay. It did not shatter it or, I don't know. I had a bump on it, but that's happened with all my cartilage piercings and it's gone away after I put a stun in it and left it in for like a week and then it just disappeared. This is a 20 gauge in right now, but I literally switched between 18 and 20 because all my normal earrings are 20 and then my hoops are 18. So whatever. It doesn't hurt. I can just put it through. It was probably like a, like a, like two. Actually, I think my eyebrow hurt more than that did. I'm going to give my eyebrow a three and I'm going to give that like a, like a, like a two. Because truly it didn't hurt that badly. It just burned a lot after like when you get your ears pierced. And then my tragus, which I got done almost a year ago. I can't do math on the spot. Oh, I can. I do really good at math, actually. I, I'm, I'm getting an extremely high A and I literally sit in that class and finish my work while he's explaining the lesson. And he, I go like hang out with my friends and he's like, Come on, get back to your desk. I'm joking. He's not East Indian. Um, but he has a weird accent. And I'm like... Bro, I'm like done my work. And then he's like, oh, you're such a good student. Yes, you are. <laughs> that was weird. I don't know. So <clears throat> I got that done in August and it, 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 it has caused so many problems for me. I was on the verge of taking it out so many times, but I like begged my parents forever and it was kind of a prize for doing stuff. And um, truly the pain of that piercing was like, like a 0.5. It did not hear it. I did not hear a pop. It was just like, oh, done. It's done. Um, pretty much. It was my first piercing with a needle. So she just like stuck the needle through. And then after she had the needle through, it, I felt like I had a giant barb just like pressing up against my face. But other than that, I felt absolutely nothing. And it did not hurt whatsoever at all. Like it was like so pain free. But after you know, that. And same with my Helix. They just hurt, like, for weeks or a week after. But my Tragus, I, like, couldn't wear headphones in it for, like, two or three months. And that ear, well, I could, but it was painful. And, um, it was just... It, it hurt so badly. I felt like I had a giant wet earphone in it. And I had had that earphone in my ear for, like, my whole life. So, that kind of, kind of sucked. It, about a month away through into that piercing, um, 
I went swimming and I had like a curved barbel in it. So like what I have in my eyebrow right now, I had it in my ear because that's what she said that she liked to pierce them with. So that's what she put in. And she told me to tighten it. But of course, I have a really small tragus and I cannot get my fingers really in my ear to fall. So I couldn't tighten it at all. So pretty much the ball ended up falling off one night and I could not get it in my ear. My mom could not. I tried tweezers. My dad couldn't. It just sucked so much. So I pretty much had to change it to a hoop in like a month and you're supposed to wait like at least three months to change it and it's not even fully healed like i think mine's just starting to like pretty much fully heal but i'm still scared to leave it out for a certain amount of time because i feel like it's going to close up in one second so um that sucked to have to change it to a hoop because i hate the look of a hoop um and then it got a bump on it and i got it to go away with sea salt soaks and then the bump came back and I have it right now, actually. But I recently went to my piercer, like, um, a week and a bit ago. And got it changed to a stud. Because I just could not do it myself. So, it looks better now. And you can't really see the bump when I have the stud on it. So. But it's blue. And it's sparkly. I advise you, before you get the piercing, to, you know be prepared for it to be a little bit happy in certain scenarios even though it's a super awesome piercing and i love ear piercing so yeah 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 ow whiplash that hurt i wonder if my cousins texted me she was supposed to we're, we're getting adventure bags oh i got a text from my cousin oh it's not my cousin it's some guy from my class it's dylan Hello, Dylan. How are you doing? <coughs> Those are my piercings. They were fun. If you have any more questions or anything about these piercings or like where I... I'm not going to tell you where I got them done because it's like a private shop. Ooh, I'm spinning. Wait in the land mass. Wait in the land mass, children. Wait in the land mass. God's going to trouble the land mass. I that was not me singing. I am... Um, <clears throat> a way worse singer than that. <laughs> oh, and if anyone's wondering what kind of piercings I want to get in the future, I want to get a sexy bull ring piercing. I'm joking. Haha, <laughs> you like me? I just changed bra. Um, I'm just joking. I have a sexy bull ring piercing. What did I tell you? See, I, uh, I have my septum pierced too. I was, that was all just a lie. That was a lie about the seven piercings thing. You're like, whoa, psychedelic. No, it moved! You caught me, it's fake, I'm joking. It's just a... I would never get myself pierced. It'd look bad on me. Put that there for now. That looks so bad with a nose piercing. I'm glad I didn't get my nose pierced. My mom wanted me to. It's strange. If you have any piercing questions, leave them in the box below and hit the button down below. Yeah, it ha one of them is like a thumbs up and one of those thumbs down. Hit the one on the right! If that is a thumbs down one, if it's the thumbs up, then hit the one on the left. I'm, I'm joking. I'm going to go shave my fetus now. Ta-ta!